Hey everyone, in this video we will quickly talk about one to many relationships in Power BI. So let's start. I've got this Power BI file open here with me and we'll just discuss the concept of one to many relationships and how to read those. So we've got a customer table and we've got a fact internet sales table. So uh, a given customer can have many orders. So for example, you order stuff of Amazon, maybe you order something today and then you order something else tomorrow. So for one customer or in which case it could be you, you could have multiple orders on Amazon and you could be ordering multiple items. Uh, so that's uh, how this relationship is modeled. So one customer can have many orders, but then one order can only belong to one customer. So uh, uh, that's how it works. So then you've got customer on the one side and you've got fact internet sales table on the many side and that's how it is modeled. So if you look at this diagram, you can see it says one on this side and there's a star which indicates many. Now let's just quickly edit it. So I'll just click on properties and you can see that. So how we will read this is that it says fact internet sales table has a many to one relationship with the customer tables. So you can say that many rows in the internet sales table can belong to one customer, but a customer and the customer can have many uh, rows in the fact internet sales table, but then one order can only belong to one customer. So this is how you would typically read it or you could re read it in, an, you could do an inversion and read that one customer can have many orders, but an order can only belong to one customer. So uh, that's pretty much it. I just want to take this up as a concept that um, uh, when we're talking about data modeling, we'll come across a lot of one to many relationships or many to one relationships and uh, essentially how we read it and uh, how, how these relationships operate. So I hope you find this uh, video useful and interesting. If you've got any queries, let me know. Uh, please let me know if you'd like me to take any specific topics on data modeling in Power BI. As we go along, I will definitely be taking up many to many uh, relationships uh, and that's a more complex topic. So it's probably be a, a longer discussion on that. Uh, it's a wrap for this one for now. Cheers. Bye.